Hi guys, um, today I have a cool video. I hope you guys like it. Um, these are the papers that I've been making. I know a lot of you guys have seen me um, work on, if you're my, you know already my subscribers, you've seen me work on these types of papers a lot in drawings. Um, well, let's see, I tried to pull some out here. They're not gonna all fit in the shot, but. Mm, there's a bunch here. This one, I'm. it's a work in progress, I'm not done. So you guys have seen these a lot, um, if you've been following me. They're like a, all different, they're all handmade. And a lot of people have been asking me for video, um, a video on how to make these, which I haven't gotten around to it. I know I need to, and my storage and my phone is low. And So the other day, anyways, I made some of these. I'm going to start while I'm talking, show them to you. So I made some of these for myself, and then I had, you know, these are the ones that I had that are I cut off that are doubles, sort of. I mean, every little part of this is unique. So, um, you know, I had extras, I guess I should say, that I thought maybe, I'm not sure, I'm just going to put this out here, maybe somebody is interested in purchasing these. Um, these take, there's how many sheets here? Um, I didn't even count them. I think there's, well, we'll count them as we go here. See, they're all different. Some of them have some glittery gold. This is a more pale one. I'm going to show them all. See? A lot of green show up in my work. I love green. This one has like a really distressed look. This one is uh, really fun to do. I, I do a lot of those for myself because I tend to just leave a little bit blank so I can tangle around. There's this one. Ooh, I like that one. The purples are in this one. Some more blank areas in this one. Hope you guys enjoy looking at all these. I know I loved making them. Um, they take quite a while to make. They are very, very labor intensive to get this much of um, depth and saturation and different color layers. They take, all in all, if you can believe this, double this amount takes about total, because I even have to iron the paper, it takes about close to three hours to make. So, the type of paper I use, I will list in the description box below. Um, this paper can be, obviously, this is the exact same paper. It can be Zen Tangled On with no problems and shaded. It can be, it's, it holds watercolor, which these, I, I mean, this paper was soaked. It holds it well. It holds microns. It's, you know, it's great. So these papers measure um, five, no, wait, let me make sure. They measure seven by, seven by five inches in length and I left them like this because I thought some people might want to do a real big tangle or you know look at this how small you can get, actually get two out of here real easy two drawings let me count them again and you can take another look one two three four five six seven eight Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Okay, there's fourteen pages here, and they um, and uh, let me think here. So there's fourteen pages, and the amount of supplies I ugh, I could own a craft store, I tell you. Um, I used on these is a lot of different inks. Um, I think that I would let these go. I have a trouble <laughs> pricing things for $13 for the whole set. It, it, you know, they're almost like a work of art themselves because each one's handmade. I can't re reproduce any of these. It's just what I, you know, came up with. And they help to make your tangles look, you know, 
pretty organic and neat, I think. And uh, I enjoy making those papers. So if I can get rid of some of them, I can maybe buy some more art supplies and keep making them. And, you know, so I thought I'm just going to put that out there. Um, so the back, so I'm going to warn you, I cannot help this. They're going to look like that. See, they're going to look a mess. I, that's just the way it is with making these. But who looks at the backs of your Zentangle, especially if you frame them or if you scrapbook them or whatever you do. I mean, it doesn't bother me any, but, uh, you know, warning, it, they, they are not perfectly white in the back. I cannot make these handmade um, backgrounds doing that. So, um, what else? I guess if, first come, first serve, someone wants to... I mean, I can, I'm going to put on the end screen my, um, how you get a hold of me. There's Instagram, Facebook, you could comment here and, uh, pretty much probably through PayPal would work for me. So, um, just let me know. I just want to see if there's an interest out there for these. So I guess that'll be about it guys. I'll lay these out and then stop the video. Can't even fit them all in the pay, um, in the in the shot. I'm sorry. Uh, oh well. So I hope you uh, like this video and um, please subscribe if you haven't done so. I usually post about once or twice a week. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.